The legendary Jim Gray. Uh, tell me, man, we're here for the uh, Garcia Rios. Um, Garcia's coming back after a long layoff. Rios is kind of a tough, hard hitting guy. How, how do you kind of see this fight playing out? Well, Danny's been a great fighter for a long time. He can, you know, six consecutive years and 33 and all. So Danny's had an incredible, uh, incredible run, incredible career. Fought a good fight against uh, Thurman, did not get the decision. Um, you know, so like he said, it's you know there's mental anguish that goes along with getting your first defeat. Took a year off, let his body recover, uh, let him get his thought process together, and now he's fighting Rios. Rios been a terrific fighter over the years. Uh, he also has had you know fought somebody, but basically he had a, had a 18 month layoff uh, before that. So. I think it's an interesting fight because Rios comes to fight, so you know there's going to be some action. And, and Danny, Danny will have you know his hands full, but uh, Danny's obviously a much more accomplished uh, uh, fighter based on his track record. But, but Rios is nothing to see that. I want to ask you, man, just a, a great boxing mind such as yours. Uh, just some of the fights that have happened recently, uh, Lomachenko, Rigondeaux. When you watch that, what were your thoughts on on kind of Rigo quitting? You know, when you're not in the ring, you don't know what a man is facing and what he's going through. And I know that was a great disappointment for a lot of people who expected more out of it. But I don't stand in judgment of anybody, particularly since I'm not getting hit and, and, and none of us are. So only he knows how he felt. No one else can tell him how to feel. Only he knows that. So I think it was a disappointment, but I think, you know, he was thoroughly beaten. So, um, probably problematic continuing it and figuring he was going to lose anyway, so I get beaten up for that. But, again, I'm not, I, I don't diminish him or, you know, he says he's hurt, he's hurt. Mm -hmm. uh, Lomach a name that always synonymous with Lomachenko right now is, uh, is a fighter fighting on Showtime in February, Mikey Garcia. How do you see that fight playing out? Two undefeated guys in their prime? Wow. Be a great fight. It'll be a fantastic fight. I hope we can see it. You know, Mikey has a fight coming up first with Peterson. Uh, don't know so, what Lomachenko's uh, plans are right now, uh, but hopefully, uh, you know, top rank and uh, Al Heyman and Mikey and everybody can get together and, and, and have that fight uh, come off on Showtime. <laughs> yeah, hopefully. Uh, just one.